don't have to cram for your exam on the metric system. Let me stop this way, she can mess a lot of bits and math all super small, and these are your right. If you try walking a meter, it's easy to complete because the meter's just a little more than three feet. But if you're walking a kilometer, it's gonna take a while. It's one, that's a meter, that's all I have to mark. A centimeter city, the reach of your feet, a hundred will go into a meter. You still with me? And there's, there's another kind of meter smaller than that. It's not very fast, it's called a millimeter, in fact. And I study, I pass another millimeter bit, that's ten in a centimeter, and that's it. Meters, liters, and grams. Now you don't have to cram for your exam on the metric system. Meters, liters, and grams. Now you don't have to cram for your exam on the metric system. Liters, measuring liquids, you can hit us. We've only got two. It won't take long to explain this. A liter, it's half a big bottle of soda pop. And a milliliter, it's just about 20 drops. There's a thousand milliliters in a liter, you know. So I've got both of those, you're good to go. Now we can move on to grams. Measuring weight, kilograms, milligrams. Yeah, we're keeping it straight. It's pretty simple. A paper clip weighs about a gram. A big textbook is a kilogram, man, but a milligram. It's a little harder to size because 10 milligrams is about a gram of rice. 1,000 milligrams is a gram. 1,000 grams is a kilogram. Now we've got the grams. We've also got the liters. Put them all together with the meters. The meters! Meters, liters, and grams. Now you don't have to cram. Put your exam on the magic system. Meters, liters, and grams. Now you don't have to cram. Put your exam on the metric system.